Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Holly. Today I am going to be planning the week of November 28th in my Erin Condren. And we are gonna dive right in with the Christmas kits because the first of December is this week and I've got a lot to use. So the kit I'm gonna be using is this Scribble Prince Co. Candy Cane Ultimate Kit. Uh, I'll just show you quickly what we have in here. It's a really big kit in retrospect. I probably, this was one I set in my haul like, I probably didn't need this one just cause it's not uh, anything like super unique. And I really, but I do really like the, the traditional Christmas colors and I kind of like it for this week because I think we're gonna try and bake some gingerbread cookies next week and just start to get into the holiday spirit. Um, and I, I like the, the quote box for that. So I think this will be good. I have not planned with a full Scribble Prince Co. Ultimate Kit in a while, I feel like, um, let's look. Oh, back in October. I did use one for October, but I stretched it over both uh, a personal and um, a personal and a Erin uh, Condren spread. It was the Scribble Prince Co. That like Day of the Dead. What did she call that one? Um, Eternal Sleep one. Uh, so I had done like a plan with me squared using that, but I have not just used just a flat out ultimate kit. I'm not gonna try and save any leftovers. I have so many Christmas kits that like, <laughs> there is no need for using leftovers. <laughs> so I am gonna go, I think I'm gonna do full no white space. I have not done a no white space spread in a while, but I think I wanna do that. So with that in mind, I'm actually gonna pull this washi closer um, because I don't need to uh, put it towards the bottom. Okay, so guys, this is gonna be weird. I really haven't done this in a while. I'm like out of practice. I think I wanna do the type where I have the to-dos at the bottom, then the little things, and then a big today section. I really have been liking having the today section at the top. I just think visually that looks, like it draws my attention to what I have going on. So I'm going to do the ombre heart checklist across the bottom here. I'm debating what color I wanna put in the middle. What do the full boxes look like? Do the green in the middle. So we are coming off of, uh, this is, I'm filming this on Saturday. So it's small business Saturday. So the sales are not over, but I am coming off of Black Friday. Whoo, I did some damage. You guys are gonna be seeing some hauls. I, like I totally, like I planned to do damage and I gave myself the permission to use part of my December sticker budget, but I use like a lot of my December sticker budget in addition to the rest of my November sticker budget that I had been kind of saving. I'd been, I hadn't been buying that much this November, at least for me. Um, so I had some, like I had a good chunk left over and then I was gonna use some of my December sticker budget just to, cause I know a lot of shops are closed in December and so I don't feel too, like I'm not too worried about missing out on a lot of good stuff in December. Like I'll probably buy a few Valentine's Day kits, but other than that, I feel like pretty set. I got a lot of winter themed kits or more like, um, I've tried to focus, I got, I stocked up on some multicolor stuff from some new shops and like got a, a decent amount of like, what are those called? Like functional deco stuff and labels, things like that, that I, um, I know I'll use and I, I figured, you know, might as well pick them up while they are reduced price. And then I also picked up like several winter kits. Um, so like that are winter themed and I can use probably through March here. Um, so I'll use those a lot. And then I picked up just more like neutral kits. So like, I don't know, the neutral look was like really speaking to me for like winter stuff. Um, it just, it like very like black and white or like very pale pinks that kind of stuff i picked up a few kits that were kind of in that genre because it was just i don't know that maybe i'm like looking at what my december spreads are going to be like and it's going to be so colorful that i'm like okay maybe after that i'll be ready for something like a little bit more subdued um that was the other thing i did i, I sat down like it took me like 
like probably like 45 minutes. This is like really embarrassing. It took me like 45 minutes to decide what Christmas kits I'm gonna use when. Like I made myself a little chart and like had post-it notes of like, of when, what, which kits I had and tried to decide between my personal planner, my Erin Condren and my memory keeping spread. So basically I have like pretty much 12 spreads that I could use um, what I wanna use when, so. And I, I, I actually stuck to, I think I bought like 13 kits, but one of them I can use after Christmas. It's not too, too Christmassy. So I actually did okay on that, but um, oh, I bought like too many big kits and not enough like personal kits. So I'm gonna have to use some big kits in my personal planner just because I, yeah, you know, I wanna use them. It's better to use them even if I don't use the whole thing than not, so. Next, I'm gonna put my meals down. Oh, I haven't planned like this in a while. I kind of like it. It's like, I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so I got the meals down. I'm gonna do, I have some bills due next. Does she have, I think she has bills in this kit, right? Um, oh wow, they actually match the colors. Oh, that's amazing. That makes me very happy. Um, so I'm gonna use those. Um, in the little things section. Yeah, I have one due on the first and on the third. That is great news. Uh, and, oh, I wanna mark down my TV shows, like I said, so I'll do that. Oh, I also have like some packages. So I'm gonna keep going with these. I, so yeah, so how did you guys make out on Black Friday? I definitely did damage. I'm also excited. I tried out a lot of new to me shops, so I will definitely share that with you guys, of course. And I think, I hope you guys enjoy seeing new shops. Um, definitely some ones I, I didn't even, I didn't order from Scribble Prince Co. yet. I might order, I haven't seen her Cyber Monday kit, but I might order there. And I didn't order from Glam Planner. Um, I just, from them, I, they weren't doing, I feel like I have everything that I want from them. Um, and none of it was like new. So I wasn't as enthused. And I have, so I have, I'm gonna mark down a package on Monday because I'm not marking down packages as much in my planner, but this is a, do you guys know what Nordstrom Trunk is? It's like a service that, it's kind of like Stitch Fix, but it's from Nordstrom. Um, and, or no, not Nordstrom Trunk, Trunk Club. And so I have that coming on Monday and then I have to ship it back out. So I wanted to mark that down. And then I also, um, it's my sister-in-law's birthday. And then on Thursday, it's my nephew's birthday, so I'm gonna put that one down. And it's also our, the six year anniversary of when my husband and I went on our first date. Six years? Yeah, six years. So I'm gonna mark that down just because I think it's cute. And then I think, oh, and then I have payday on Friday. Does she have like a payday sticker? I think I'm just gonna take one of these and um, use it, like I'm gonna put a little dollar sign over it and use it like a payday sticker just cause I want that down in the little things, not in the main day. I'll put that down once I have the header down. And then I wanted to put down those bills. So let me put one on. Thursday and Saturday. Oh, and my videos. Actually, I think I'll put my videos in the sidebar because um, I don't really have that much else that needs to go there. So I think I'll put my videos in the sidebar. So now I'm gonna put the rest of the little things headers down. Okay, so next up I'm gonna go through and fill in the white space. I'm definitely gonna save this box for up here. And I think I'm going to cover the November because this kit doesn't really have a lot of black in it. Um, so I'll come back to that. And then here, I'm gonna space these out. I wanna try and get it so that I don't have to cover up the super cute ones um, with activities. So I'm gonna space them that way. So we'll give this a go. So on busier days, I'll probably try to use like some of these, like ones I don't care as much about covering up, but the gingerbreads I want to kind of stand out in the candy cane. So we'll find room for them. I don't have a crazy, I have a pretty busy weekend, but I don't have a crazy busy week. So hopefully we can make some room here. So let's get going.
So I think I'm gonna do this uh, part kind of filling in the white space. I'm gonna do it sped up because it does take me forever. But then I'll come back and talk you through like what I have going on every day. Okay, looking good. And then I want to, I think I'm gonna do my sidebar before I come back to the today section. So for the sidebar, we have all of these little lists. We have the weekly ombres. I have a leftover uh, ombre heart checklist. And then we have the habit tracker. So this is perfect. You do get a lot with the Ultimate Kits. I will say that. I don't know that I need it all, but um, it's nice to have for sure. So I think I'm going to do just a little bit of layering to make it look um, a little festive. But I don't really have much washi left, so I'm just going to call this, I guess, to do. I wish she had one that said, like, goals. I want to use this week for... YouTube and yeah so although I kind of want to use uh, I guess I will use the this week for my habits okay so I'm gonna go ahead and put down these habit trackers first FYI, I did just duck out for an, through the power of editing. I, this is two hours later, and I went to an exercise class, so I'm still kind of in my post-exercise class garb, so hence the outfit change. I've got my little Lululemon jacket on. Oh, I wanted to get this filmed before I showered, which probably is TMI for you guys, but my husband's in the shower, so... Wanted to finish this and then so those are the habits next I think I'm gonna do just because these are the same color I'm gonna do the green one so that it, to kind of break it up a bit and I will do that as my to-do list So I'm gonna take this to do header or should I make that a to clean? No, I'll just do it as to do and then I'm going to Take some washi and just put it in behind it. Yeah, for the most part, I film things on Sunday, but on Saturday, I do always try to get my Erin Condren done so I can get it up pretty early on Sunday for you guys. Because I know I like to sit there and watch YouTube videos on Sunday morning. Is there anything greater to, than watching a bunch of Planet Maze on Sunday morning? Let me know down below if you're doing the same. That might be crooked, but we can fix that later. And then I'm gonna take this list. And then I'm going to do, instead of doing a header, I'm going, cause I don't really have a great one that works for YouTube. I could call it work, but I don't really think of it as work. So I'm gonna take the little, uh, YouTube clapper icon and put that like on top of that or you guys will see what I mean That looks pretty cute and then I'm gonna take the go for the maroon one Put that there and then I'd love to get a little to clean list at the bottom. What do we think can that fit? Mm, barely. I'm not going to have room for a to clean header, but I think that's fine. I'm just going to take a little strip of washi to break it up. Great. Okay. That is a stacked sidebar. I like the way that looks. Um, a little, a little crowded, but I think I'd rather have it be crowded and functional than not. Okay. So now I'm going to go through with my day by day and put in my plans. 
I will admit my plans are like a little bit up in the air right now. I'm just not quite sure what I'm doing when um, in terms of, well, some of my workouts and stuff, but we're gonna do our best guess here. So on to Monday morning, I am going to go for, I think I'm gonna go for a spin class, I think. Um, so I'm gonna take the little quarter box here. I think that's will fit. Like a little short. I'm gonna grab one more piece of washi. Well, maybe I won't go to a spin class. Maybe I'm gonna go for a run. I might go for a run. So I'm gonna take this little running man. I think I'm actually gonna go for a run because tomorrow I'm probably gonna go to yoga. So I can run on Monday morning, which is good. And then on to Tuesday, um, and then the rest of the night, I'm gonna like do like YouTube after work. So I might take this little flat, this little, little thing. And I'm just gonna cut this into a flag so I don't cover up the cute gingerbread man with something bigger. Ooh. Sorry if I can't edit that out. Um, so I'm going to put that little flag down for just to mark down that night. I'm gonna do YouTube onto Tuesday. Tuesday morning I don't have anything going on. And then Tuesday night I'm gonna go to an exercise class. So I'm gonna take this maroon box. Then I'm gonna put this, I hate to cover up the pretty flower, but oh well, I just wanted to leave a little bit more room. And I will put in the exercise class there. And I'm gonna take one of my Planning Roses workout stickers for this one. I think this green goes well enough. I have to order more of those, definitely. I think she's doing a sale today, so I'm gonna place an order. So that is there, and then I'm just gonna take one of these flags that are here. It's just gonna be kind of like a lazy TV night. So I'm gonna take this red flag Put that there and then I'm gonna take the TV because um, I, I like to watch I like to sit down and actually watch both Brooklyn Nine-Nine and New Girl I just lost a sticker what was what, where did that go just left off the paper guys I have no idea where that sticker went but oh well um on to Wednesday I am going to take an appointment box, I think, for the morning here. Do one of these thicker ones to mark down that we have a cleaning service coming that day. I'm gonna take this cute little vacuum, put that here, and I'm gonna take the time dot. I think it's, they come at two, so I'm gonna take this little time dot because why not? I have them. Actually, I'm gonna take one on Tuesday as well because I never use these and I'll try them. So this class is at 6.30. And then on Wednesday night, I really don't know what I'm doing yet. So I'm just gonna take a half box, put this here and leave it blank for now. I think it'll just be like an editing kind of night but in case I decide to do something else, I'm gonna leave that blank onto Thursday. So Thursday, either Thursday morning or Friday morning, one day I will probably work out and the other day I probably won't. So, hmm, I'm gonna put it on Thursday and just kind of know that it might move to Friday given my personal schedule here. And for this one, I'm gonna take a sneaker from Planner-esque and I will take this green color that goes pretty well. I need to order more of these also. And Thursday night, I don't really have anything going on right now. So I'm going to leave that blank and I might fill it in later in the week. Friday after work, I do, Friday morning, I think I'm gonna get coffee. So I'm gonna take a little, teardrop and try to not cover up this cute little design we have going.
And I'm gonna take one of these little coffee cups from here. Oh, it leapt right here. Did anyone else see that and like totally was like, Holly, what are you missing? It's right there. So anyway, put this back. coffee cup on Friday morning, which reminds me, I do want to take a trash can little thing, or I mean a little icon on Thursday night because we got stuff to take out. So for that, I'm just going to take this little thing and just cut it into a little flag to mark that down. Okay. And then back to Friday, Friday night, I have a an alumni event. And honestly, kind of I might not go, but I'm going to put it in. I probably should go and just make an appearance, but it's like, it's like halfway across town from my office. And it's like to make an appearance is still like a two hour level of effort that I'm not sure I want to do, but I will put it in. I'm going to take these balloons because it's like a holiday party. Um, so I will put that in for Friday night. And then Saturday morning, I think I'm going to work out. And so I will take another quarter box and I will take another hmm if there's any colors that go I think this green is too bright this red is probably a little too bright but I think is probably fine so I'm going to take this there and so I'm going to take do that exercise class that morning and then that night I'm actually going to the White House so pretty pumped about that there is an event where people that work for the administration, they have like an open house and you can bring whoever, or you get like a set number of guests and the Obamas will not be there, but it is still pretty cool in my opinion. So uh, we're going to that, very exciting. And then we're gonna go get dinner. So I'm gonna take a half box. And how do I mark this down? I'm gonna do, how about a house? Tan house, not a white house. Um, I will do this and then the dinner. So, and then put that. Oh, I didn't mean to do two red boxes on Saturday. That looks a little silly, huh? Okay, and then on Saturday, I do also wanna get some filming done. So I'm going to take this flag I'm gonna take this planner mark that down and I'm also going to take this little munchkin now that I'm looking at it I'm gonna put this on this event even though it's not like that exciting but just to have it there and then I also want to go back to Monday and because it is Cyber Monday I'm gonna put I'm just gonna put this like maybe I'll just put this here and I won't I'll just put my YouTube tasks down in the to do's just because I really want to use that munchkin let's be honest but that is Cyber Monday so I do know there are some kits coming out that I'm gonna have to take a look at and then on, um, that's it for Saturday. On Sunday, I'm gonna do a workout in the morning. So I'm gonna take another one of these quarter boxes. I'm jamming on these for workouts, I guess. And here I wanna go for another run. So I'm trying to get like one longer run in a week. So I'm gonna take another sneaker icon. Oops. And put this here. And then I'm gonna take this half box and try and cover up just to use it since I already kind of ruined it. Um, I'm gonna take this little munchkin. I don't know, is this like payday or is it like she's holding stickers? If she's holding stickers, then I think it works for like filming. So we're gonna use it because it's so cute. Covering so much of these pretty flowers, but oh well. And then I need to put something to cover that. So I'm gonna take a little, is there a camera? There used to be. Here it is. Put 
this here. And then I want to mark down, actually, ugh, I'm gonna move this back. This is, has to be ruining things here. That looks a little mauled, but we're good. And then I'm gonna take a flag to mark the Bills game. So I'm just gonna cut it into a flag so it doesn't look as weird, I think, in the spread. I don't want to flip this, even though the TV will be upside down. I'm just going to put a TV icon over it. Because it just looked kind of like unbalanced with everything on that side. And so I'll take this little TV icon. And that looks really cute. I'm going to take this little laundry basket and put this down here because Sunday is always laundry day. And I think that's it. Let me cover, use these little flags to cover this up. Do you guys, this is a very specific neurotic question, but when you cover the flag on the left, do you put it under? or over the quote box. I think I have to put it under today because otherwise I'm gonna cover up part of the quote. But I kinda like the way it looks when it's over. Looking good. I didn't use this little one, but that's okay. It's so cute. I love that she has munchkins in there now. Now I wanna do the date stickers and we have the date dots. Oh, I wanna add more time dots. The event on um, Saturday starts at 5.30, so I'm gonna grab that. Put this here. And then the workout on Saturday morning that I think we're gonna go to is at 11. I'm gonna take that. And this, I don't know what time that starts at. I think it starts at like five, but I don't think I'm gonna be there at five. So I'm not gonna put that one down for that, but I think those are cute to add. Okay, now let's do the date dots. Oh God, the weekend banner. Oh guys, my life, I am the strugglest. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and lay these down. I'm gonna do it so there's just like a sliver of white space in between the date and the header just to make it look a little, I don't know, more, less cramped. This is a very busy spread. Okay, so next I need to figure out where to put the weekend banner. As always, I totally forgot. So I could just kind of cover up these date covers a little bit and like cut off this extra. I might do that. And I'm just gonna cut these off, even though I do like the way the little tassels look, but. Yeah, that doesn't look as nice, but. That's what you get when you forget your weekend banner. So I am going to also try and figure out where to put this girl deco. I think right here is the obvious solution. So let's see if she can fit. Because she is pretty. I think this is one of those that was drawn by like J. Crew plans. So if I can kind of take her, I can write pretty small on there. Or should I? I'm already, I'm marking up the page, so I need to set it down. We need to make a decision here. So my to-do section on Monday, I'm not gonna get to check anything off, but I think it's worth it because that is so pretty. So that works, and then I have the rest of this deco, but I'm gonna go ahead and fill things in first, and then I will add the deco at the end. So I will be right back. Okay guys, so here is what we are looking like so far. Obviously there's still some things to fill in and I kind of fill my to-dos in as I go, but I really like how this looks. It is crazy festive, crazy busy, but that's kind of uh, representative of December in general, I guess. So I like it. I'm definitely getting me in the mood, definitely make me want to bake cookies and just kind of, I don't know, I'm excited. So next, I do want to add some of this final deco in. I'm just going to add, I mean, it's already such a busy spread. Why not go crazy with it? So 
I'm just gonna put some of these pieces down here. I think I'm gonna put this here because I do wanna bake gingerbread cookies. I don't know if I'm gonna do it on Friday or um, probably on Sunday. Or maybe Friday, maybe I should do it Friday. Maybe I'll do it Friday. Okay, so I have all of those in. This looks crazy cute and crazy crazy, but I think it's a lot of fun. So let me show you what I used up from this kit. I used up all of the full boxes and all of the heart checklist. I used up pretty much all of the washi. I have some little things and sidebar headers left. Some of this sheet left. I have all these checklists and little boxes and date dots, so I will hang on to that because these colors could coordinate with other Christmas spreads. Same here with these and the icons, flags, and it's always nice to have extra weekly ombres and extra half boxes. But definitely made good use of this ultimate kit. I, um, you know, never, didn't feel like I was short on anything, obviously, because you get so much, but it's nice to feel like you used up a decent amount. So I enjoyed doing this. It was fun to go back to a no white space spread. Let me know what you guys are using kit wise this week are you diving into Christmas like I did or are you you know trying to stretch fall a little bit farther so let me know down below and go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe to see more I've got tons more Christmas spreads coming so definitely subscribe if you want to see those so thank you guys as always for watching and I'll be back soon with another video bye